Alright guys, how's it going? Hello! Welcome to episode 23! Ba -ba -ba. Let's get right into the action as always! Let's go! Throw! Oh no! You have bounty roads? Can I see the sheriff's office? No idea. Of course, of course. Oh, and here is my dear friend, Arthur Callahan. Boy is a hunter. Boy is a killer. Arthur, you've met but not been introduced to Mr. Oh, I'm so sorry. Sheriff. Gray. How are you doing, sir? I'm fine. Tough business you boys had. We did? Oh, there's no need to pretend with me, sir. Life can be tough. So it can. And no man owes another anything. No, sir. But still, I feel you were hard done by. Losing your employment like that? But still, here in Rhodes, we have work enough for honest men. Oh, that's some strong stuff. Still. Don't seem to be doing you any harm, I guess. Exactly. Whoa. Excuse me a moment. Oh, it's daytime. Oh. I told you we was moving up in this world. Deputies. You have finally <laughs> lost your mind. Amongst these drunkards, hillbillies, and slavers? Good honest thieves like us. We're bound to be moralizers in a place like this. Oh, Sheriff Gray, you are back. Now listen, sir. There is shine in them woods, though, and it is cost in this county its good name and the state a whole lot of income. You boys wouldn't mind rooting it out. Maybe we'll make you permanent. I gotta set me down a second. Not a problem, sir. Not a problem at all. You are in safe hands now. And people waste time with the temperance movement. Liquor never dulled a good man's senses. Arthur, you ride with the deputy. Bill and I will follow. Climb on up. Let's go. So we're Arts deputies mode? now? How are you? Pretty good. Uh... And your friend is behaving himself? Oh, <laughs> yes. I think he's learned his lesson. Congratulations on becoming a temporarily deputized citizen of Scarlet Meadows County. Most towns just get bounty hunters to do their dirty work these days, but Sheriff Gray believes the law should keep the law. Now, I'm sure I don't need to remind you there's a chain of command here. There is? Dang straight there is. This is a dangerous business, but follow my lead and you'll be just fine. Sure. Hey! Archibald wants to remind us he's in charge here. Of course. Who else would be? But you were a big help with them Anderson boys, and I put in a very good word with the sheriff on your behalf. We appreciate that. We rounded up the others soon after. I'm pushing for the rope myself, but that's by the by. So, these moonshiners. Not just any moonshiners. Braithwaite's. I told you about the uh -oh. Braithwaite's. Pretty sure you did. Old Cotton family had a fortune at one point until, well, a few changes in the labor laws. Now they're dealing in moonshine. We found their stills hidden all over Lemoyne. Quick as we destroy one, another one pops up. You could call it a pitiful fall from grace, if they had any grace to start with. I have no time for tax dodgers. Not to mention the fact that Catherine Braithwaite has a rather expensive interest in thoroughbred horses to maintain. But I heard something about it being gold these families were fighting over. Well, that's the rumor. But the Greys and the Braithwaites think the others stole a fortune from them. But it happened so long ago, I don't know for sure if it's true. Must be tough being rich, huh? <laughs> so I imagine. That badge rather suits you, Mr. W. Yes. I thought so, too. Does it feel good to be back at it? Serving your asses, country? Like you gotta I blend in. Go you kiss his butt, we'll I'll never find out. Whoa! Whoa! Hold up. You see that wagon? 
dear me, that don't look good. Oh. Jeez. Come on, mister. Ooh, Keep no. your eyes open. Yeah. Try washing once in a while. Oh. This must have happened recently. Mm. Hey, mm. come have a look at this. Look. Suit and tie. One bullet clean through the forehead. Well, my money says this is the handiwork of a gang called the Lemoyne Raiders. Yeah, I've run into them. Let's see if we've got any identification. Okay. We should get going. I'll send someone over here later to clean this up. Rusty's just going along for the ride. Mm -hmm. Maybe like a can of beans or something. The almighty can of beans. Okay, girl. Why are you getting rusty? I didn't want to do that. But, uh, Let's go. Do. There's nothing more we can do here. Why are you getting on that side? Would you mind taking the reins? I want to have a look at these papers. Sure. I'll direct you. Okay. Frederick Mitchell. <laughs> Lamoine State Legislature. Poor fella. Yes, this certainly smacks of the Raiders to me. Bunch of ex-army free staters without an ounce of respect for the law. Mm -hmm. Easy. We ain't in that much of a hurry. Go right. right at the crossroads. Yep. Not the nicest fellas in my experience. Oh, and I know the Braithwaites are in business with them. No shame. Trash begins down. trash, my mm -hmm. uncle Reginald used to say. Bear right again here. He had a few stories, let me tell you. Town preacher and town mm. sheriff. The drink a sailor under the table before breakfast. He had one tiny hand, like a child's, on the end of a grown man's I like arm. That tree. But anyway, this tells you what kind of people the Braithwaite's are. Selling moonshine to murderers. I tell folks don't even speak to him. Don't even look him in the eye. I'm sure I wouldn't. Here we are. So what was I saying? Something about the Braithwaite's, I think. Even saying that word makes me sick. Now, anyone we find here, we bring in alive, understood? Round them up, then take this operation down for good. Come on. Let's see what we're dealing with. See? See? What did I tell you, boys? What did I say? I said this place was crawling with vermin, and we just... ...ourselves the rat's nest par excellence, as they say in Paris. My aunt, she went to Paris back in 78. How will you handle this? Well, the way I... Actually, let my friend here decide. He doesn't have your fine way with words, but he is definitely the man for the job. Let's split up. Arthur and Bill. Me and Archibald. You boys want right or left? We'll take the right. Let's stop these filthy, degenerate tax dodgers. The cheek of them. A fine idea. Us. Remember what he said. We need them alive. Let's just knock them out and then tie them up. Got it. Deputy Williamson. Hold back. See if they split up. Forget the rider. Don't round him up later. Get the other one. Did you see him? No, I saw you above the box. 
job, Bill. There's hell over here. A lot of bugs. Just drop him with the others. I think that's it. Well, what do we do now? We better destroy all this. Any of your boys can handle explosives? Sure. Anyone but him. Oh, so you're real funny, don't you? Tell me about <laughs> that. Is the last time I'll mention it, I swear. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. Uh, where's the dynamite? It's in the weapon wheel, it says. It's right there. Oh. Wow. I you drank dynamite. I was like, what the flip just happened? <laughs> I don't think the health type gives you any health, sweetie. I think it's just a buff. I didn't mean to drink that to be honest with you. Exactly what I had in mind. I thought it was. I didn't know it was done. I thought it wasn't done. Okay. Oh gosh. You just gonna hold it? Gonna plant it or? You gotta move. Where? I don't know. Last time it gave you the option to, to put something down. It's not even giving you the keys now. Oh god, gather. We got it, boys! <laughs> Second time's a charm. <laughs> Shit! We are mad! Oh, oh god. I got him! <laughs> what if you need that later on? Maybe. Is that a dead cow? Yeah. Oh no, it's a rock. Oh, we're looking around. Get out of the way, noob! Does anybody have any beings? I just don't get hit, I guess. Just remember that that screen doesn't pause your game. Oh, the I don't want to do that. I'm hitting that on a shirt for you. I didn't mean to do that. I think there's a guy right there. I 
think that was your prank, sweetie. Yeah, me too. That's why I'm here. Can you eat that stew? I don't see any more. That's see a you? good push. No. Let's find Dutch and get stew. out of here. Fine by me. Please have beans. Or no, I need something. Come on, Arthur. I'd rather not be here when our friends notice the shine's gone. Dang it. We need your vegetables. How does yeah, it feel? Something. Oh, wait. Being a fine upholder of the law. Not that different to our normal life so far. Alcohol. Uh, not exactly what I needed. Who were those fellas? Not sure. Probably the people they were selling to. Guess we can't ask him now. And I thought I was protective over my liquor. Do it. <laughs> Don't want to get in that ass swamp. You know some crocodiles? Mm mm. Alligators. Um. Well done! <laughs> Well, forgive me, but me and my men must return to our lives. Ah, seems like we failed to destroy the last of the moonshine. Sure. Would you like us to? Well, I normally take it for personal consumption. It's sort of part of the job. But I better get back home. Why don't I just take a jug or two and leave you boys the rest to show that there's no hard feelings on account of the war? We are all Americans. Of course. My cousin, Webster, he used to say some of us is not as American as others, if you know what I mean. Only I didn't quite. Come on, you degenerate, no good, white trash, hillbilly piece of scum. I know you, Billy Lime. Finally. You've always been a Finally. piece of crap. Come on, move. We have a life move on a land so stupid, a backwater so backwards that even we are like geniuses. <laughs> Bill, get this stuff out of here. Come on, you ride with me. Okay. Should I stash this somewhere near camp, boss? Yes, show it to Hosea. I'm sure he can find a use for it. Bit of trouble back there, Arthur? Ain't there always. From what they was yelling, I think they were the buyers. Old Archibald didn't ask too many questions, so neither should we. I ain't planning to. That was worth the effort, though. Deputized and hiding in plain sight. These lawmen. These two families. I mean, I really think we can play this from all sides. It's got Hosea written all over it. This is starting to sound like the Young Dutch again. What do you mean? Crusty the size of young course. Dutch. I'm as strong yeah, as I've ever now. been. Hey, you know or what? Maybe it's an illusion. No, Why my legs are longer for sure. I think. <laughs> she grew up. Well then, deputy. Hmm? I would love to, Dutch, but I got some other business to attend to. Oh, you do, do you? You know you'll never outrun me and the count. Anyway, I'll see you later then. My throwback wood. Stay out of trouble. Alright guys, that was episode 23. I mean, who would imagine we're gonna be the deputies of the town? Let's see how long it takes until they find out. God. Well, especially since you robbed Leviticus Cornwall yet again, so... Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna come back to bite you in the butt real for soon. Oh well, yeah, let me just uh, take one of those uh, off your hands and you can take the rest back. Well, that one's not Cornwall. That one was the Brave oh, I, I think. I just think it's funny that the guy's like, let me just take one of those, uh, you know, usually... Usually I take them all, but I'll just take one this time. Mm -hmm. Leave the rest to the all. Yeah. Oh, I know why the freaking sheriff was so drunk. You <laughs> can't miss Hooch. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed it as usual. Please like the video, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you know when the next video is as always, and have a good one. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.